October is National Bullying Prevention Month, and a Warner Robins mom wants people to know just how serious the problem is by painting encouraging words on rocks. Sabrina Burris joins us in studio with how she's getting them into the community. Amy Gorton says she had no idea how present bullying was in schools until it happened to her daughter. That are paired up can take more. That's okay. fine. These group of women have something in common. These rocks, Amy Gorton says some Houston County folks joined forces to paint more than 200 rocks with special messages on them. We had a bike rally for my daughter on the last day of sixth grade. She's been a bully victim since third grade. Kind of had enough. Ashley Gorton is in the seventh grade now. Her mother says she was diagnosed with ADHD and Asperger's in kindergarten. Yeah, I did do that one. I didn't she have did this that one. one. I like that kid. Can't we all just get along? Some of the rocks have messages about confidence, love, and a little humor that people can hold on to when they find them around town. Sharon Matsey says this campaign is close to her heart because she was bullied into adulthood. You know, people say you're not going to stop bullying. Well, if we all felt that way, how can you change anything? Gordon says you have to start somewhere. I mean, if we could impact one child's life, we've done something. Her daughter, Ashley, says the support has helped her stand up to bullies. Helps me see that I'm not alone in some instances. Gordon says she wants to spread awareness nationwide. I would personally like to clean up this area and move on to the next, but you know, one thing at a time. Some of the rocks are easier to find than others, but when you do find one, it's yours. Lori, back to you. Thank you, Sabrina. Gordon says she plans to have an anti-bullying float in the Warner Robins Christmas Parade this December.